I'm here. Hey, hey Ron, your boy's here. <laughs> Ready to break down this heads up battle royale. With all my heads up knowledge. Man, I sound real good in this mic. I sound clear as a bell. Oh. So let's say Ryan's uh, going to start calling. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, th I feel like he's starting to kind of like ratchet up a little bit. But I think uh, I think Chris is going to have the advantage in the heads up match. Um, just because from what I've noticed uh, about Ryan is he doesn't, I wouldn't say understand heads up, but I don't think he has a heads up strategy. Like, I don't think that. I don't think he really thinks in that way. I think he just kind of plays. You know, I think his mindset is you have to play more hands, but he doesn't understand necessarily the value. When and of why? Those hands. Or, yeah. Well, like here, this is interesting. I mean, at least he's not just giving up. But he's using the power of the button. I say button, funny, funny, don't I? Button. The button. Button. That button, though. Ryan, I got out in. Fifth place today. Unfortunately, I ran good as always. Got it in with the best. That's how I do it. Ryan putting a little raisin chips together here. Nice. Doesn't Ryan have like put have like the pose right now? Like, like I want to bluff you. Like his shoulders are hunched up. Like I'm ready to go tackle someone. Yeah, like a young uh, Hulk Hogan. Very young. Same beard, mustache. They're playing some poker right now. I mean, I'm I'm kind of surprised by this. You haven't seen this like in a heads up match. Is Chris just calling? I mean, uh, this is a. <laughs> he's calling because he's, he's calling with the power bait high. He's calling with the power bait high, but I'm just interested to see what would happen when it breaks. Like, is he gonna ship it? He's just gonna give up and 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 what? He's gonna win with eight high. He's gonna win with eight high. If if Ryan checks here. I mean, I guess if I was in Ryan's spot, it'd be. Oh, oh, oh my god! You hate that, dude. Thirty k pot, and he wins with a die. Jeez. That was so weird. Ryan's so mad right now. Bowl, so. Jeez, you bet I'm that on. last one. So, what do you think's Go worse, on. the call by Chris on the turn, or the check by Ryan on the river? Shit for that one. I'm gonna guess. Though. Um, I think Ryan giving up is, I guess it's fine, but I think Chris should be betting. I mean, I, I honestly think if if Chris is going to put that much of a stack in on the turn, I think he should just ship over his race and just let's let's tango. What's I'm saying? He, I mean, he put like 65%, if not more, of his stack in on the turn. Like, it's kind of crazy. I was, I was going to. I was, God, I was going to. Check. <laughs> no. Here we go now. That's why I don't like checking like good hands on the flop, just because people like to see turn cards and river cards so often that you want to get the money and when it's good. Looks like we need to clear it. Clear the hand. Thanks for the spoiler day shift. Nice. I was just recording it. No big deal. And it's only to keep track of chips, right? Only to keep track of chip counts, right? I mean, so at this point, it doesn't matter? So what do you think? Uh, it does, but... Oh, is Cooch, is Cooch's butterfingers out there? Is that what's happening? Three.
Interesting. Very interesting. I mean, I get not, I get defending wide, but that's pretty wide. <laughs> Check. There's mega wide. And Ryan, and, and I feel like, Ryan's isn't it like an automatic C bet, especially on like a board like that? <laughs> like and now you, and now, now you, like obviously we see that Chris has like the nut low. Just checking it out. It's like a, I don't know. That's such a good board of C bet. It's so it's so infrequent that Chris can connect, and in turn, it'd be a great spot for Chris to check right. Good night, Lynn. I hope you have sweet, beautiful dreams. A mustached Bobby. Great, <laughs> yep. Oh, here we go. Did he just call? Yes, three straight. Oh, okay. No. Ryan did, though. Ooh. Three's coming. Everybody knows the three's coming. Chris actually has a chip lead now. Yeah. For like 1.6. 45. I'm okay with this, with Ryan calling one street here at least. Ew. Looks like Chris is trying to get some value out of maybe some flush draws here. No dice though. Now Ryan's a little bit back on his heels. Got me thinking real hard here. Oh, they got me. They got gotcha. you. <laughs> I've joined it. Uh, the uh, the brow is real. The brow is real. Not messing around. Oh, well, no. Chris is turning to run spicy. Oh, yeah. This is the time to do it. You've taken the chip lead from the monster stack. 45. And, and it all happens when he doubles up through me. <laughs> I'm doing that a lot lately. At the shoe yesterday, this I... This could have been you. The first hand I sat down, I, I posted when I changed... I had a post because I changed tables. Uh -huh. And I had queen nine, and this guy went all in for $10. So I called. And he ended up winning. And, like, literally, like... 45 minutes later, he had like 400 in front of him. <laughs> I was like, dude, you ran good. He, he had like a... This is actually kind of crazy. So, it went check from Chris after raising preflop. Ryan bets now Chris check raises all in. Which is interesting to me because that's a, a lot of chips. I mean, I know you have kings and it's heads up, but he could very well have an ace it's heads up, you know? I almost kind of, I kind of thought that uh, Ryan might call there between. And I don't necessarily know about the all-in, you know. I mean, if you're getting so many hands of full, like perfect example, he had a queen. He could have gotten another bet or two. What, <laughs> if, what if an ace hits a turn? Now, obviously, you have no credit for having an ace. Oh, oh, <laughs> <Jesus. laughs> hello. <laughs> Dude, I bet you could walk out into any rainstorm and just keep your eyes dry with that sucker. It's, I do this when I run. <laughs> Yeah, just keep the sweat out of my eyes. Forget the uh, forget the, the headband. You just rock the uh, the solid brow. Well, this is what happened, kids. You you shave it, and then it grows in thick. <laughs> you, need just, you need to quit shaving. And here, to I always I always thought that was a myth. It's not. Look at me, prime example. This game that lasts any longer, I'm gonna have a five o'clock shadow. <laughs> it's amazing. Are you on like some human growth hormone or something? Uh, you know, I just wash it and condition it. <laughs> Solid move. 51,700. Oh, we're doing a quick chip count right now. I think they're like almost uh, flip-flopped from when Ryan doubled up Chris the first time. 27. 
know somebody that I played poker with that looked, looked exactly like this. Boy, I think I have 27. Yeah. Unibobby. <laughs> that's Bobby with an I. Oh, yeah, that's that's yeah. a whole different ball game. Yep. My neighbor growing up was a Bobby with an I. Was it a girl? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Cool. This is going all in. Can I just predict, predict it now? I feel like now I look like the people that a couple of people I play with at the shoe. Oh. Oh. I knew it. Oh yeah. Man, that was quick. King Ten's obviously winning. I say it. King Ten's obviously winning with a four flush of hearts. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> happened last week like this nope. too. Nope, this is what happened last week. We had to we had to suck in the resuck. Jackaroo on the river. Kapuya. Nope. 27 exactly. JK. Yeah. Yes. And here we go. Exactly. 20, 1, 2, this is 3, just the universe 4, 5, saying 6, that 7. they missed your voice. And they want to hear you a little bit longer. I guess so. I was planning on just giving a you know a bust out interview and here I am. <laughs> Back to white. <laughs> the rest of the night. I mean, I was gonna go to the shoe, but this is much it's more entertaining. Okay. It's uh it's not dead, but it's just, it's an awkward time for me, and I've been trying not to, like, become a vampire again and play till like, 6 a.m. Um, yeah, I mean, if I go up there, it's already going to be starting to die down. And no, you're, you're business schedule now. You're business Bobby. Kind of, I guess. You go up there, you make your chatter. I'm after school special Bobby. <laughs> that mustache, absolutely. Stranger danger. <laughs> Oh man! Careful, kids. You see this guy coming out, walking at you down the street. He did not hold his hand. I tried. <laughs> I don't even offer candy. It's a kid over. It's your own fault, man. <laughs> okay, <laughs> quit. No, I can see you being like, I got better loads of candy. I'm not quite day shift. I'm prime time, Bobby. Yeah, you are prime time, Bobby. I mean, you might as well get it while like, getting's good before they close down the poker room. I don't know what I would do if they closed out a poker room. Move to Pittsburgh. I would move to Florida. Move to Florida. <laughs> yeah, forget Pittsburgh. That's a much better option. Pittsburgh is not bad, though. I, the, I went there, and I actually enjoyed it. The place seemed a little bit different than the one, two tables. It was one, three. And they had one, like, five, five game going, too. But it was early in the day. And I liked it. It was not bad. It was easy. Chris flopping everything. Oh man, we've had some uh, software issues tonight and some hardware like issues. Only, only when Boston was on on the uh, iPad. Usually it's the cooch. Gets a pair to go along with this flush. So, uh, Ryan back with the chip lead here. Chris says, walk it out. Oh, Bobby, you like there's like there's like Brazilian kids that uh, have the unfortunate hair <laughs> growth. I don't know what's happening. Oh, <laughs> it's just falling out. Danger. <laughs> <laughs> Chat says leeches. Oh. Staples is just running hot. Sixteen. Ryan must have felt that Chris had to nut low there. I wish I could get heads up just once. Show these boys how it's done. You are a phenomenal heads up player. 
I appreciate that. You're welcome. Sorry. It's alright, we can wait. I mean, here my I, I did record all those sessions we had at a point now or so. There's only two of them. So he's. Maybe here in a second. Now. Maybe we drop them. We'll see if Ryan Might gives the walk with the uh, the low lows. Why not? Thirty two. I do believe that is a min raise, unless we are at uh, six twelve. I I don't remember where, quite where we're at right now. Pew, 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 pew. Chris enjoys that flop more so than Ryan. Ooh, Ryan's got a chance now. Did we have Pokey Girl in the chat tonight? Did not see Pokey Girl. She hates me now. Sick turn oh. card though. So Ryan only bet 16 oh, my, my, my. when he raised it 32 on the flop. Four? Sorry, Ryan. You're not going to win this hand. Uh, no, book it. I know. <laughs> it's not anyway. <laughs> Unless he just shipped it. Air. Air and shows it. <laughs> you could have just said air. He didn't have to. Like I have five days. I would have just. I would just throw my cards off the table. Arranged. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't even throw them in the muck. I would just throw them to the back door. I don't want to show these ones. Humana, 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 humana. Don't break our concentration or anything. Who needs concentration? Eh. You ever use concentration when you play poker? No. no. I don't need to concentrate. All my decisions are pretty much right there for me. Yeah. I just sip on chocolate milk. See, and kids, just this is why you don't upgrade to Windows 10. Man, he was really on it about that Windows don't 10. Don't jump on the bandwagon. Luckily, we didn't, I don't know much about that from earlier. Is that a situation? Um... I don't know. He just got a attitude with me because I said, he said that Tony just upgraded Windows 10. I was like, yeah, I just did that. He's like, so what's good about it? <laughs> just like start going off. And Cliff was like, well, that's what that text was. Okay. Cliff texted me. He's like, he's like, tell me, tell me why I should get Windows 10. <laughs> like, okay. I think I have Windows 95 on my laptop. I don't know. It's done, me, it's done me fine so far. That's why Chris is a cool guy, man. He knows everything about everything. Fell asleep. <laughs> yes, sir. There's a person in our in our chat right now. I'm not sure why you're not talking, but your I'm name sure is Poopy Taco. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Poopy. Shout out to Poopy Taco for the most awesome name in. The Poopy Taco, if you're listening. Hop in the chat. Let us know how you came about that name. Was it a drunken night at Taco Bell? <laughs> <laughs> Was it a dare? <laughs> Did you leave your taco on the floor and your dog pooped in it? <laughs> I'm wondering if this is hard or soft. <laughs> the world may never know. Oh, man. <laughs> it's such a good username. Hello, Grego. You're not Poopy Taco, but we love you nonetheless. <laughs> Alright, so we have a hand going on here. Ryan actually has a pair lower than Chris's. And it looks like betting and calling. 16 bet, 16 call. Sixes. Seven. Everybody, it's like the river, everybody just shuts down. It's like this Nobody even thinks about doing anything. Like, you know what? I think my sixes are not good here, but I'm just going to... 
I was gonna check it. Yeah, I mean, was he? I don't, I don't quite understand the call in a turn. I mean, I guess he feels like I have some showdown value, but I, I mean, your head's up, so like, it's time to get a little more aggressive. Yeah, I guess I'm just, I'm just, I'm just uh, held to the metal. I don't know. Type at him. Fake him. Call. Oh. Yeah. So on top. Thirty six. <laughs> uh, C H Grego wants me to tell Ryan he is a big three star person. <laughs> you big three star. Ryan's turn to outflop Chris. Watch, he's gonna have a piece. He's running that good. I think we gotta stay chipper and look happy no matter what happens. So that way the people at home are like, ah, oh, these guys are so excited and Ugh. so ecstatic. I mean, look at our dealer, look at his face, he's so happy. This is the first time we've really had problems. They should have brought a bottle of wine. I think they'd probably be kissing by now. I honestly partway feel that. The reason there's not as many viewers as we usually get right now is because Chris made it to be. Quite possibly could be. Two. Is this hand still happening? Two and a call. Ryan, naturally. <laughs> All the sixes. <laughs> naturally will get there, unfortunately for him. Um, wow, that was calls with King High, so it's like, you know what, let's try to be nasty, turns out you have trips. Is Chris looking at his hand like, like I can't believe this wasn't like, good. Like you misread it, or is this like, I do believe, uh, Ryan has a small star, star, star. Yeah. Huh. I don't, I know what that means. They won't do that. They should just make the, the blinds and he's 5,000, 10,000. They should just chop. That was a bad call. CH Grego should come up with better burns. <laughs> I agree. They're kind of weak. There might be a, a website for that. Betterburns.com. They might be sideburns, though. You might have to look down the That's like, a little further. That's like, your mama's so fat. She broke a leg <laughs> and gravy came out. Like, <laughs> come on. <laughs> Let's be a little more creative. Yeah. I am, uh, I agree. If you're gonna troll, at least be a day shift troll. Seriously. Hit us with them zingers. Bring something to the show. Make us laugh. I dare you. These guys aren't telling any jokes. No. The only thing we can laugh at. Alright, <laughs> I can't. I'm not gonna go there, because they're gonna rewatch this, and they're gonna be like, Aah. 36. I don't think I've ever played heads up this long ever in my life. I mean, what are the blinds? They're 600, now? I think they're 816. Oh boy. 40 bucks. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> Chris is never 45. They are opening up their game a little bit now, though. They're well, that's opening. what's weird, though. They're 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 pretty wide preflop, but they're not really goofing around after that. It's interesting though that they've they're changed already, like the blinds are way higher than they were when they started heads up, and they're playing like how they should have played when they first started heads up, and now it's like, I don't know. I'm pretty sure Siege Craig goes like 11. <laughs> you guys should come up with better burns guy behind the camera. If we were behind a camera, how could we be on oh. camera? 
Unless we were like really fast. I guess he means us. <laughs> I'm assuming he does. Your burns are very, <laughs> very. S hashtag. <laughs> hashtag camera. <laughs> oh boy. This is what it's come to. We should go out there with a mobile mic and just commentate from right behind him. <laughs> that would be fun. Chris is actually bluffing with the best hand there. Sometimes that happens. Dude, we are setting our personal record for most resets in one night. Got to reset it. Never mind. Same one. Is that is that Dan? I think so. I don't know what it means though. Dan, you're more than welcome to finish out your night in the booth. Oh. I'm your, just here. Do your job. Two more. Hey Chris, are you thinking of a flop? This is it. <laughs> I mean, just bet and get it over with. I mean, come on. I figure out telling Ryan. When he looks down at his chips, he usually bets. Check. How sick would it have been, though, if Ryan would have bet turn and Chris would have called and Ryan would have bet river? Right, counterfeit. Counterfeit? <laughs> he got counterfeited by the river. You he just, yeah, because he's just going to call it a nine. <laughs> I got counterfeited, but I still kicked the crap out of you. I don't think I can use it to call anything. That just proved everything what he just said. <laughs> that just proved our point. We asked you, you asked, you asked us, you, we asked you to make us laugh, and you just succeeded, so yeah, I appreciate good. it. Sick burn, bro. Thank you, Chigrego. <laughs> got him. Me. That was uh, that was <laughs> pleasurable. I must say. Chris with a like, three to two chip lead. I want to say. Is it? I thought they were about even stay. I don't really know. No, I guess this question I thought. I'm getting pretty good at this. Check. Eight. Check. 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 Eight. Good. <laughs> he should have said. Eight. He should have said seven. Seven high. I just want a cooler to happen at this point. It has to. I agree, assassin. <laughs> it's not necessarily painful, but I, I do want them to do something. Do you uh, want some pain, actually? I do want some pain to happen. I want like. That would involve them actually playing the cards that are dealt to them. Alright, ready? This is the hand. All right, look. Ace 4 versus Ace 2. I'm on the button. I have Ace 4. Let's raise it up. 38. And I'm in the big blind? With two jacks. <laughs> now this makes you question. He called with 7-3 offsuit earlier. Now he's folding queen five. What's his strategy? It's just, he's a field player. You no, know, sometimes you feel like you trying to end this for like you wanna time go home. play and sometimes you Chicago. feel like you just sometimes you feel like a nut. Yeah, sometimes you feel like a nut. Just go away. Just go away, he says. Well, the way you guys are playing, somebody's gonna go away. They in won't. In an hour. An hour? <laughs> Lines are gonna be All right, twenty-five thousand, fifty thousand. <laughs> let's do a let's do a Laden thinks. Let's do a Laden thinks with chat. Make somebody in chat Laden. Ryan C, do you know do you know 
how Laden He's thinks works. I don't know what Laden thinks. Is. I always do so with it. This could be it. This is the hand. This is the hand. Nope. Check the checks. No, it's gonna check, check, check. Five six. controls. So six. six is kind of bad too. Oh, cool. I guess I called for six. And I got it. I could be playing some sweet, sweet League of Legends right now. Is it still sweet? <laughs> like, are people still like about it? Uh, dude, it's the most popular game in the world. We're at the big race. Damn. S hashtag S I N T. Come on. Call. I got a call. Yeah, nine. That might be it, guys. Ah! Oh, I got out. He's got a nine, <laughs> a four, a six, or a six. I think you got or a five, him, right? And that's Maybe. it, guys. You should. Wow, they were really close. Those. Ryan only had 1.5k left. Cap says they will kiss. Good. <laughs> good game. Nice oh, great. Look, this dude took 20 minutes to have a comeback. Let's, let's see. Oh, hi. <laughs> Look at you all clean shaven all of a sudden. I am. I'm all clean shaven. All my uh, leeches fell off. But... Yeah, all your uh, weird hairy moles. See you later. So, so that was a uh, an epic heads up match. Our it was easily, it was so epic. Easily our longest to date. Uh, Ryan wins again though. That has to just be a just a canker sword in your butt crack. Right I mean, now. it just it's it's disappointing. It's disappointing to say, that, but um, I mean, he deserves it. You know, so he's worked hard in his game. He studied. He's he's got here. I mean, he's he's. I mean, he's made. He's had some good hands, but he's he's made him work for him. Yep. I mean, I guess when you have that many hands, it makes you look like a maniac. So at the same time, you know. He's uh, a maniac. Don't let me stop you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right. I mean, hey, it is what it is. Ryan won again, and it's great. It's awesome. Um, I'm assuming people want to come in and talk about their bust outs and. I'll leave them to it. Okay, but real guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. I do appreciate Thank you. It. Eden Assassin, you were right. You did call out the uh, the final hand. Come on in, Chris. Come celebrate your uh, your second place finish well, after, after the epic heads up battle. A little longer than I'd like. <laughs> you prefer less than ten hands. I, I absolutely prefer less than ten hands. Get it over with one way or another. Tried to take him out with the ace queen early. The king ten got there, and I, I just couldn't do anything. Um, I was surprised that I came back from like uh, seven eight thousand. So I'm happy with my finish today. Yeah, we're uh, when the it was three handed, and you had about seven, and that had like three thousand. We thought it'd be really funny if if you would have busted third and it had been Ryan versus three thousand chips, but. Uh, you made it worthwhile. Uh, obviously, heck of a comeback. You had a chip lead for quite a while. The heads up match, you just, uh, you know, couldn't hold on with the ace queen. Obviously, would have just been the, the finishing dagger of the night. But uh, I think it was it was it was interesting. You guys, you guys had a very very wide range of opening or starting hands, but you guys didn't seem to like keep the the pedal on. Like you guys were like pedal the metal pre flop, then it was kind of like oh, there might be a cop up ahead. I better slow down. So you guys, Absolutely. but I think I don't know if you guys have much, you know, experience playing. You guys heads up are probably zero, I imagine. So you're probably trying to feel each other out, trying to figure out best way to attack your opponent, uh, you know, on both sides. So obviously you did a lot of it right. It just, you know, it turns out that you got kind of unlucky with the ace queen. I mean, I I never played against Ryan heads up, so it was entirely different. Um, I definitely wanted to try and open with a lot more hands than I did the rest of the day. I, you know, tightened up today, tried to play a lot more solid um, just to kind of keep those points going. Uh, being so far behind, I, I think I'm 60 or so points behind Ryan mm -hmm. and now um, even more. So, but I, I gained a little ground on everybody else. So that was nice. So we can only hope that, you know, next week I can catch a couple hands and, and take Ryan down early. That's my hope. Yeah. I mean, obviously you want to win first place, but like we talked about, there is a, a final wild card game on week 13 where the chip stacks are appointed as your, your finish throughout the season. So if you end up getting second place, starting with that bigger chip stack going to the final game obviously can be a huge advantage. Yeah, absolutely. It, it'd be great to have that advantage uh, against a lot of these players. 
I, you know, if I if I open a lot of hands, I'm going to get called. I I think people have have noticed that I will play a lot of hands a lot of times, so that's why today worked to tighten up. But in you know coming weeks, I never I don't know what I'm going to do till I get here. So. Yeah, sure. I mean, it's sometimes it's it's not the best idea to come up with a game plan. You just kind of do what the defense gives you, as they say. And if, you know, if the people are playing passive, you play aggressive, and vice versa. Can't argue with that. So. Like I said, next week I hope I can, you know, do better for for all the fans out there, and and hopefully people like me. But you know, if you don't, um, you know that's okay too. You guys got Ryan, so I, I say root for Ryan if you're not going to root for me. Speaking of Ryan, real quick, one last one last thing. How did you not get slapped across the face when you won with eight high? <laughs> I, I, I'm telling you, um, you know, I, I think there's definitely a, a whole lot of luck to this game. Um, you know, with, with eight high, I, I think he had a five seven, and, and when I called out eight high, he he was very hesitant and and didn't want to do anything. So I just you know thank my good graces on that one. Of course. So and, and he, I tried to play a three six against him and, and flopped it, but just couldn't go anywhere. Yeah, he didn't have a whole heck of a lot, so it was kind of tough. I'm mean, actually the river card you thought maybe yeah, beat you. Definitely feel kind but of actually on that actually river. It gave you a little bit of a extra value out of that hand. So yeah. But, uh, congratulations on your second place finish. Uh, you shouldn't be saying that. You got second place. That's a, that's a great finish. You should be really happy. But uh, let's go ahead and bring in our winner here, and uh, we'll talk to Ryan a little bit. Thanks again, Chris. I'm pretty sure this is what all of Ryan's opponents are thinking right now. They're just like, uh, how do I catch? Oh, you got your own? You got your own? <laughs> there it is. What else can I say? Is it your mom or your dad? Oh, that's me. <laughs> oh, gotcha. <laughs> that is me. Welcome in, Mr. Uh, I just win, 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 win. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. But, uh, so is this, is this your third win? No, it's my second. Second win. Two second. wins, two seconds. That's pretty solid. I feel the same way. <laughs> and you're, you're really beginning to uh, outpace your opponents here. Like, like you're going to have to start getting eighth place to, to give them a chance. You know what I don't understand is I've I've been told multiple times I'm probably the worst player at the table, but so far I'm running pretty hot. I've never said such a thing. I don't know. I'm still I I think the hand that makes me the most upset right now was my seven five versus, I, the, I, versus the eight high. I needed to barrel. You wanted to so bad. I did. I did. You, and, you said it after the hand, which you know is common poker talk like oh i was gonna like there's always i really was but i could see you you either stack up you're like do i need to bet all this chips yeah don't make a bet that commits him i could see you i could see the, the wheels turning it's just so hard he checked it's, calls i know i know and chris's range is so wide i i, I can't well, i'm sitting there playing i can't even say what does chris have I have no idea. I'm just throwing chips out there. At least with the other players, I've got an idea in my mind what I think I'm playing against, yeah. but with him. Right. And then, you know, I, I really got lucky on my king-10, ace-queen hand. Yeah, um, I mean, you know, I was live. I was happy with that. A relative flip. Yeah. Um, I think that I was more excited tonight to see Cliff and Pizza Mike go out early. Sure. I needed that. I wanted to see Chris and Bobby uh, last and Rudy a little bit longer. And I was hoping Annette would go out earlier than she did because I think she's been at a solid four, three, three or four, five the whole time. I think, so. she, I think she's a, a two, three, four, five is are her finishes yeah. now. So that she, probably puts she, her above Pizza Mike. She will probably be in second place now at this point, I do believe. Yeah. So. Yep. So yeah, I mean, you're the overwhelming leader at this point. Second, third, and fourth are getting a little closer. Mm -hmm. uh, but you know, the bottom of the pack still not out of it, as you can say. We're only we're only a fourth of the way through. Yep. So maybe the, maybe the next four games, someone else is going to run as hot as yeah, you are. Yeah, you're exactly right. And you never know. I mean, you're that's, exactly that's, that's right. why it's fun to fun to play. But yeah. uh, I was, uh, we'll talk about the run the run good real quick. Yeah. You had some. You, I mean, you just it was just crazy. It was. I mean, you know, pocket kings, seven seven deuce, king on the turn. Yep. And you know, I I probably should have checked it to let Missy continue on, especially after last week when she said any anytime she has a big hand against me, she's gonna go hard with it. So you, you, and you I knew that. that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I I've got uh, you know, believe it or not, for for being a donkey, I probably have a pay, at least a page to a maybe a half a page for some of notes on every player that that I play with here. So I mean, I'm definitely trying to come in prepared. That's good. Um, I mean, with I, my play. We were just kind of talking to Chris a little bit about not having a game plan, but that's a little bit different. I mean, 
having it yeah. having a, a hand history or some overall knowledge that you can kind of reference back to before you play is much different than saying like tonight i'll be aggressive tonight yeah. i'll be tight right like, you can't you can't do that because you don't know what your opponents are going to do and you don't know what you're going to be dealt i mean if, yeah. you're, if you're dealt monsters every other hand you might you might look like a complete spaz that's playing every single hand but in in all actuality you have legitimate hands that's yeah exactly you know i i did plan on coming in playing tight tonight i think that was kind of evident the first hand whenever there was a raise to i think 200 i folded pocket eights mm -hmm. um what, the, on maybe on the button yeah. i might have been on the button at that point you're, but you're a button or cut up i believe yeah but i was like you know i'm, I'm all right with with kind of just sitting back let them kind of go at it a little bit i'm still going for the win every week but in the same token i felt like i had an opportunity to to let somebody else go at it and i my plan was to only play premium hands tonight sure i mean you got a lot of them so you you made it yeah. most of it and uh kudos to you so do you think there might be a situation where it's going to be a kind of a gang mentality against you i i'm surprised it hasn't been already it's almost like the team that wins a championship the following yeah. year they have a target on their back and everyone gives them their best shot yep so well i've had a game plan for that the entire time if i wasn't the chip leader I like to share it, but I don't want, and I'm afraid that everybody's going to watch this. There's no that's reason there. to. But, they, you know, they, they I, probably, if they've listened to this, they might have fallen asleep by now. See, I kind of thought that too, because our heads up match was kind of boring. But, uh, you know, I definitely have a plan if somebody would have moved ahead of me or when somebody moves ahead of me to, to try to juicing things up a little bit to help sure. help my play. Well, on that note, congratulations. Uh, you're Thank you. You're doing phenomenally. I wish you all the success in the world. But that's going to conclude our show tonight, guys. So I hope you enjoyed it. I uh, can't wait to see you guys next Thursday. Same time, same place, 7 o'clock here on Twitch. But until then, have a good night, everyone. See ya. Thanks. This guy can't be beat.